and I'm back. What's cool? What's groovy? What's happening? It's time for life. Today we're going to be making a no butter cake. You need six eggs which you're going to whip up for five minutes straight. You can use a hand mixer or a whisk if you want to get some muscles. Just whisk it for five minutes straight. And as you can see the consistency changes and it becomes very extremely foamy. Then we're going to add one cup of sugar and one fourth teaspoon of salt. You're going to whisk this again for five minutes. Now the sugar, you can actually do white sugar as well, but I only had brown, so that's what I used. Whisk it for another five minutes. Add one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and from now on, you're only going to be folding things in to make sure the cake becomes very spongy. So this is one cup of flour, and we're going to sieve that in the sieve that I got from Ikea. You're just going to keep pressing the handle until it's super fine like powder, and it's self-raising flour. Don't forget, you guys, it's self-raising flour. We want this thing to be like air. And we're going to fold that in. Make sure you fold it not too briskly because we want it to have that airiness to it. We want it to be like we're eating clouds because that is what this cake is like. It's like eating delicious clouds. So as you can see, there's so many air bubbles in there, but make sure you don't mistake air bubbles for pieces of flour that are still stuck in there. So make sure you do a good job with the folding. And once you have all those bubbles, what you're going to do, you're going to put in your container that you're going to bake the cake in. And you're going to beat the air bubbles out, just like so. And bam! You got your soft, spongy cake. You can put Nutella on there. You can put anything you want on there. And just enjoy. No butter cake! Now, according to my Latina friend, this tastes exactly like... That. So I guess that's what we're gonna call it. But it's a no butter cake, y'all. And it's delicious. It is like eating delicious clouts. So give it a try. You won't be disappointed. As always, these amazing beats were brought to you by Young King Learn. This one's called Haya Gomen Gomen. And you can find links in the description on how to find him. Make sure to see all my other amazing cooking videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram like this video and subscribe make time for life y'all mm.